its opponents call it a cult. The Church of Scientology has been making headlines because members like John Travolta and Tom Cruise are facing boycotts because of their beliefs. Now those same stars are battling back and talking with an extraordinary frankness about their controversial faith, as Jan Carl reports in this Entertainment Tonight cover story. I am a Scientologist and I do not want to be discriminated against because of my religion. I was pretty shocked. The situation is much worse than I anticipated. John Travolta, Ann Archer, and Tom Cruise are just three Americans who have felt discrimination for believing in Scientology. Their faith in the preaching of L. Ron Hubbard is taboo in Germany. There have been government-supported boycotts of Travolta's movie Phenomenon and Cruise's Mission Impossible, but now, for the first time, the stars speak out. I couldn't believe it. I thought, well, I thought that's old-fashioned. I thought that was over. Those days were over, you know. Um, that's something that you read in history books or something, but not something that's today. John told me he talked to Tom Cruise about the discrimination at the Golden Globe Awards. He said, can you believe it? I said, no, <laughs> I can't. You know, it's, uh, he said, are you getting a lot of questions about the Germany thing? And I said, uh, well, some, yeah, you know, each uh, movie that comes out, I, I get them, but uh, he said, it's amazing. America recognizes Scientology as a nonprofit religion with some 8 million members who are encouraged to believe in God. Germany says it is not a religion, but a big, profitable business. The controversy hovers around Scientology, charging money for courses that offer help in such things as reaching goals and relationships. It's only the, the well-to-do people they're interested in, not the poor. It's the only people claiming a church to, who does not have any interest in the poor. When I spoke in the uh, town square, uh, I got very scared. For one moment, there was some hostility. Ann Archer has been a Scientologist for 20 years, but her faith didn't prepare her for what she faced in Germany last week. There was an irrational person who started yelling and stirred up some... They could, they could sort of hear what I was talking about, stirred up some negativity. Ann traveled Germany hearing startling stories of hate, and we were there with her. I have been spit at, I have been threatened, I have received threat letters. The people on the street are, oh my God, a Scientologist. Scientology spokesperson Lisa Goodman is outraged by the treatment of these people and by a government official's quote in an LA Times article saying Scientology, quote, aims at world domination and the destruction of our society, end quote. We own one building. How we're supposed to dominate the world <laughs> from there is beyond me. I don't feel like uh, we're, we're doing anything to uh, create domination anywhere, do you know? I mean, we might have the box office, but I mean, you know, that's a good thing, I think. I want to be able to put my head on my pillow at night and know that I have helped people uh, and exposed this situation because it is very serious.